Wistful Creations by Stephanie. It is raining outside. I don't know if you can see that drizzle coming down, which I hope it cools things off because it was wretched and humid here in the Midwest today. You might hear some thunder as well. Um, but anyway, I've got a ribbon haul here. I have two boxes, not one, but two boxes today. All the way from, this is the big boy, all the way from Miss Allison out in Arizona where it's hot right now too. But at least it's not humid, girl. I know because I used to live where you're at. The Midwest. Humid in 80 is terrible. I'll take 100 degrees out in the desert any day. But anyways, we're going to start with the little guy. I'm really excited to get this ribbon, by the way. My invoice so I can tell you guys what my colors are. I don't have that stuff memorized. I got some solids. And for those of you that have no idea how big a 100-yard roll of ribbon is, I didn't either until they arrived. They are the size of my head. Actually, probably bigger than my head because I think it covers my whole face. This is a 100-yard roll of ribbon that I got in solids. I got some red and some white. What other pretty color is in here? Oh, mint. Mint and Tropic, which will be fantastic for all those fun pastel -y, spring, beachy themed bows. Also, I've got some embellishments in bubble wrap. Thank you, Miss Allison, for packaging those. So very nice so that they don't arrive all busted and broke. So the theme of the main design You've got some seashells here and starfish and sand dollars and some glittery other little um, shells and starfish and bubbles. These things are so cute. I've been looking for them everywhere. And she finally got her hands on some. So her main design that uh, I'm going to be opening in the other big boy box, as I call them, um, has to do with the sea, obviously. I've done a, a ribbon haul of Miss Allison's ribbon before, and it was her Big Bad Wolf collection. And I told you that she's known for doing some of the darker side ribbons. She's trying to make everybody happy. So she did something a little more quote unquote normal, and it is absolutely beautiful and really exciting. So she did a, a mermaid line, and I've got a bunch of different colors here of it. So. This, it says, um, Mermaid Kisses and Starfish Wishes, which is a really cute saying. So you can see here that the little pearl in the oyster and her tail and fin are that silver laser foil is what that's called. So this is on the white. We've also got it in, oh gosh, Tropic. Sorry, I should have done some homework and at least had this memorized for you. This is really pretty. So there's the Tropic. And then I've got Navy and Light Coral. And I think this Navy one is beautiful. The blues really pop on it. The silver laser foil really pops on it. Oh, this one's beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. So mermaid kisses and starfish wishes. You can see that shimmer. It's really, really pretty. Bye, Miss Allison. That ribbonology, making everybody happy, doing a normal print. And this is on the light coral, which is really pretty. Some of my favorite colors. If my craft room ever gets done, which he's putting my gutters up for my ribbon right now, it's a really pretty cabana coral and Bali Bahama breeze color is what I chose. Because they're pretty. And then we've got um, some mermaid crowns. And a mirror. Um, what else is on this one? Mermaid crown. There's that oyster in the clam again and the mirror and some starfish with that silver laser foil. So that's the white and I got that in the navy and the coral as well. The coral was a really hot color this year. So the navy is always timeless. I never used to be a navy fan, but as we get older, things change. Maybe we just wake up and realize what's, what's going on out there in the world. I don't know. 
So here's the light coral, which again, really pretty, really kind of shimmers and sparkles. And then she's also got um, anchors and little starfish. It's kind of a cute little filler for everything. So this is that tropic again. And the light coral. Whoops, you don't want to see the tape. The light coral. And then I've got black and navy. And so you'll have to get your bright light to see the difference here. It looks like this one's my navy. And this one is my black. Oh, there, maybe you can tell there's a little bit of difference. But when you get them up next to black and navy, then you'll really be able to tell. And then I've also got that in the white. Sometimes white is just so pretty. So that was her mermaid kisses and starfish wishes line that she did. And I also got a ton of filler ribbon because she did a lot in the laser foil. And that's kind of the, the big in thing right now. So she's got her loopity loops. Which I love because she names them like I would. I mean, that's what I say. Well, it kind of looks, it's a, it's a loopity loop. I mean, I don't know. So this is the Tropic, which I think I don't have any, but uh, her Mad Hater, which a uh, ribbon line, which a lot of people have. Her loopy loops are featured in that. And if I just made that up, I'm sorry. This is the Plum, which is beautiful. These are just some random colors. Because we've always got something that these will go with. This is the shocking pink, which is gorgeous. And then the light coral to go with the collection. If I can get this guy open. Sometimes I struggle. This is what happens when you do things live and you don't already have it all prepared. So there's the light coral. This is black. Without all the other blues, I can definitely tell you for sure that one's black. The white. And I guess you could do it whatever way you wanted. White. Red and navy are what's left. Christmas is coming up, so that red will definitely get used. And the navy, because I already told you I'm starting to like more of the navy, so that will get used as well. So that's her loopity loop line. And then, look at these. I got 25 yard rolls of these because they don't look all that fancy dancy on the roll, but these horizontal stripes look so pretty for bows and stuff. So this is that silver laser foil again. This is Persian pink. We've got navy again. Of course we do. So there it is on the navy, plum, it's almost like Christmas getting ribbon, I love it. There's the plum, which is really, really pretty, on white, very, very pretty. What else do we got in here? I think this is shocking pink, yes it sure is. Which I really, really like that shocking pink. I'm usually not a pink fan, but the shocking pink is really, really pretty. Here's some more pastel colors. Longest video to date. That's what happens when you get a big, big boy box. This one's really pretty. This is ocean blue. It's a beautiful pastel blue. This is light coral. Same line as her mermaid kisses and starfish wishes. Here's my black, which will be really fun for Halloween and anything else. And I've got three more colors here, so bear with me. And then I've got one more here for Red. This is the Tropic. And then this is the Candy Apple. Green. Which again will be fun for the Christmas or Halloween or whatever, some fall stuff. So that's her kind of horizontal stripe. And then I've got one more design that I did whole 25 yard rolls of ribbon in. And these are her, what does she call them? I don't want to mess this up. Fantasy 
swirls is what Miss Allison calls her swirl line from Ribbonology. So here's your light coral. These are really pretty. Going to be great for a ribbon. In white. And the red. So very pretty. Here's the plum, which I really love. I don't I haven't seen too many people design their ribbons on plum, so this will be a very beautiful accent to give things a pop. Maybe I'm just partial to purpley plum because it was my high school colors. We were purple and gold. Here's that really pretty um, ocean blue. Very, very pretty. Kind of crystally like. It'll be great for Christmas. Here's the tropic. And you can see that there is quite a difference there. You can tell one's more of a green and the other one is the blue. Sometimes they, they look similar when they're not shown together. Here is the Persian pink. And the shocking pink. So one is a little softer pink. And you can see that shocking pink is definitely a little more wham-bam in your, in your face. Here is my black. The apple green. Very, very pretty. Oh, it's gorgeous. And finally, the navy. Oh, you can see them poking there. The navy there. Let me get those out of my way. So... Awesome ribbon haul today. I am stocked up on fillers now. Thank you, Miss Allison, with Ribbonology. So her mermaid kisses and starfish wishes line and her fillers for that, plus just general fillers to get me all set for the winter. I don't need to order anything for a while, but we know that that's not going to happen. Um, so if you need anything, come find me because I've got a lot of this. I'm only going to be stashing a yard or two here or there because I know that all this stuff will get used. So if you're looking to do pre-orders on these designs so you don't have to fight over them and pay a little bit more, or you're looking to just grab a yard or two, head on over to my group. It's facebook.com forward slash groups forward slash blissful creations supplies and buys. Click the join button. There's a little member form just so I have all your private information logged away. And then you can join in on the pre-orders or pick up random yards here and there. You can see all my pretties. I order from several of the different U.S. designers because they all just do different things in their own little twist and they're all just gorgeous. And you can never have enough ribbon, can you? I think the rain has stopped just in time to head out to the county fair. It's wrapping up tomorrow, so I think we're going to go do that. Hope you guys all have a lovely weekend. We'll see you back soon. Take care, guys.